here we have to find the domain of sine of log of under root 4 minus x square by 1 minus x. Here sine is irrelevant because sine can take anything, whatever value that you give within, within this, as long as it is real, sine of 4, sine of 10, sine of minus 10, whatever, sine will take anything. Only thing we should be worried about is this log function. Okay, log is defined when it is a positive number. Log of positive numbers only is defined, right? Log of negative numbers, log of minus 4, log of minus 10, these are not defined, right? Now, this one, let us look at this log function. Then, if this has to be positive, root 4 minus x square by 1 minus x, if it has to be positive. So, first, obviously, the numerator is the square root, so this has to be positive. At the same time, denominator has to be positive. Okay, if the denominator is negative, then the fraction will be negative. That is not possible. At the same time, 1 minus x cannot be equal to 0. Right. Now, 4 minus x square should be greater than 0. Log is defined for greater than 0. So, great, now it's not greater than or equal to, it should be greater than. What does that mean? x square should be less than 4. What does that mean? Minus 2, x lies between 2. Right. This is one part of the story. Here, 1 minus x should not be equal to 0. So, that means x should not be equal to 1. That is another story. At the same time, 1 minus x should be greater than 0. What does that mean? x should be less than 1. x should be less than 1. So, we have these three conditions. All put together, what does that mean? Minus 2 less than x less than 1. Okay. All three conditions taken together. Okay. So, x cannot be 1 because then it will be 0. If x is greater than 1, the denominator will be negative. Then log of this function is negative, which is not possible for us. So, what is our domain? Minus 2 to 1. Both are open brackets. Okay. We cannot take minus 2 because this will become 0. Okay. So, that is why the open brackets. We cannot take 1 also. So, this is the correct answer. Minus 2 to 1. Very simple problem. Hope you like this. Thank you.